Hey, what's going on guys? Robert Rams here with the new GTA 5 for the free guys today. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys probably some new stuff that you've never seen before or never heard of before. Because in this video, I'm going to show you guys Johnny's Coffin. I'm going to show you guys a little bit of the intro from Ron's trailer. Because I never knew he had actually some kind of intro. And also, I'm going to show you guys a billboard, a huge ass billboard, which says Los Santos 2020. Normally you have that poster, but I found a billboard in the coding a while ago, but a lot of people haven't seen that video, so I'm gonna share it once again. There's a huge ass billboard found in the coding, which is n like nowhere else to be found in GTA 5. Also, there is a stage at Stab City which have three lights. One of them is blue, one of them is green, and one of them is orange, and like those could represent Franklin, Michael and Trevor since they have those colors if you play as them and do missions. So yeah, some weird ass shit is going on in this video. I hope you guys enjoy it and let's get started because if you guys check it out right here. So next to Trevor's trailer there is Ron's trailer if you guys seen that from the cutscene. And I was curious to see, because Ron was standing in the doorway, if there was an entry or something like that. Because if you guys notice, like right now, <laughs> nope, the door isn't open. So we are going to check it out with no clip. And to my surprise, there is actually something behind this door. It's just a little room right here. A little hallway, I think. There is a door. There is a light. There is not much he would say or think, but there is actually something on this door written. I'm trying to read it, but it's kind of hard to read it. But there's actually something on this door. Maybe a hint, a clue, something, a riddle. I don't freaking know what it says. Maybe it says like the video or something like that. I don't know. Guys, check it out. It's really interesting. Maybe you guys can find out or see what this door actually reads so moving on we are gonna go to step city and since like i'm i'm playing gta 5 since the beginning and i never knew that there were covens in the mission friends reunited a hold of this whole place you're lost but you are not forgotten brothers we'll find that motherfucker it's kind of funny to me that I'm playing GTA 5 for 4 years and I've never noticed that it's even in the freaking cutscene. So I checked YouTube and there are only 2 videos talking about this coffin and one of those videos are not even properly like uh, titled. So I found this very interesting. There are 3 coffins right here if you guys can see and uh, this mission is played out later. Um, there's a mission where you, of course, kill Johnny. And I, I freaking hate it how Rockstar Games handled this situation right here. And just killed Johnny right here in a freaking cutscene. Um, I kind of hated that because I love that character. But there are two other coffins right here. And those two coffins are from those two other dudes. I forgot their names. Also killed in that mission. And this mission is played out later. So I assume that... Those three coffins are from those three dudes that are killed in that mission that you play. And this is crazy. This is crazy that I've never knew that there are coffins. And also I tried to actually drive this truck right here. I first tried with one and then I tried with three. But yeah, that doesn't really... Look at this. And it's just a red loader. It doesn't really work. The casket, the coffin always falls out. So that was kind of disappointing. Maybe it did have a purpose, but it's just an empty coffin right here because we also no clipped inside. And moving on, I wanted to show you guys something for those who not know. I made a video a long ass time ago about the stage right here with three lights. One of them is blue, one of them is orange, one of them is green, possibly representing Franklin, Trevor and Michael right here because if you play with Michael he has blue if you play with Trevor He has orange and Franklin has green. So I placed the characters right here. Look at this. This is amazing Look at this the characters. I placed them right here in that old ass video I actually did a hangout with them and tried to place them on the stage right here But that didn't work so I kind of modded this in right here and it looks amazing, but nothing really happens. 
Michael is there on his blue spot, Trevor is on the orange spot and Franklin on the green spot. This is crazy, but look at this also right here. If you pop the light, the light's still on. The light's still on. I don't know, maybe it's a fault by the developers right here, but the light is still on. Unlike different lights, if you take out lights in GTA 5, which you can, then um, yeah, there will be no more light. Uh, in, in, in freaking underground tunnels, at Mount Chiliad, at various places, if you take out the light, the light disappears, the light goes off, but here the light stays on. Moving on for the next subject, I got something that you guys probably already know, but I found something in the coding which a lot of people don't know. Right here we got the poster of the Los Santos 2020, right here, I think you guys probably know. There's an alien and Los Santos 2020 on it. There's another poster that appears at the Omega Trailer Park, the same poster, but I found something a while back in the coding that there is a huge billboard. And I'm gonna show you guys that right now. Look at this right here. We got a huge billboard right here which says Los Santos 2020 with a destroyed Los Santos in the back. Look at that right there and uh, alien the same alien from that poster this is actually like the billboard we got the poster we got the billboard which is very interesting because look at this right here something happened to los santos and another thing that's very interesting is this billboard is nowhere to be found in gta 5 only found in the coding which could mean that it's cut content or actually come in as a DLC a DLC some GDA youtubers speculate that there is a single player DLC cut from the game which included aliens and all that and right here it says Los Santos 2020 uh, I initially thought it was the release date of GTA 6 2020 but why does it say Los Santos because I don't think they are gonna do that again in Los Santos so right now I made it daylight in order to see it better uh, I, I actually tried to read like what it said right here so basically this is a movie poster a movie that's coming out Los Santos 2020 like what is going on right here what does it say right here maybe a clue maybe a hint but it's like for me impossible to read because those textures are too blurry to actually read what it says right here so i wanted to share you guys those stuff you may or may not know i didn't know about those coffins right here of johnny i didn't know there was a little interior at ron's trailer and on his door there's something written if you have time check it out where yourself maybe you can read it what it says on his door and yeah it's interesting stuff right here once again i hope you guys enjoyed the video look at this right here at the ranch it says subscribe now or go to hell <laughs> so you know what to do subscribe now like the video if you enjoyed it my name is robert Rams. i want to thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one bye bye